Hey there everybody, Pop on Top here. Welcome back to some more Fallout 4 mods. In today's mod, we got a weapon, but kind of two weapons. Um, this is the Silver Baller and the ICA-19 Pistol. This is obviously from the Hitman series of video games, right? Very famous dual pistols. Unfortunately, you can't dual them in this game, but you have the ICA-19 here, which is legendary that does 50% more damage against humans. Shoots the .45 rounds. And the Silver Baller, which has 43 base damage, also shoots the .45 rounds, and does plus 10% damage on aiming down the sights. The silver baller is you know, silver. If you guys want to craft these for yourself, you do so at the chemistry station. It's easy peasy life, right? Just where they are. You go to utility, that's where they're at. And, you know, alphabetically, so it depends on how much stuff you have in utility here. But the ICA-19, super easy, cheap to craft very early on in the game. No perk requirements. And the silver baller is a little bit better, so it requires gun nut too. But the same kind of material requirement that is actually quite low. So, we're going to take a look at the two weapons at the weapon workbench here. To see what kind of customization we could do. See if we can make them custom in some other way, right? So we got the ICA-19, this is the, the, the kind of weaker one. We got a refined receiver here, obviously just maximize damage, comfort grip, simple mod like that, quick to check mag, can't make it bigger. And you can put a suppressor on there. I mean, that seems about right, right? Silver baller, I got anything else? Nope. You get up to refined receiver. Are they both doing 100 damage? No, nope. it's still, silver baller does get up higher in damage, right? But the ICA is better at killing people. I bet that 50% damage I mean, does stack it over. Comfort grip, right? Improved aiming speed, quick to check mag. And the suppressor, right? Obviously, you should put suppressors on them, though. They're Hitman weapons, right? That's kind of the deal here. They did, the waddles look pretty nice, though. Not amazing, but, like, nice enough. That sounds like the Hitman sound, right? Doesn't it? Like, if you got the actual Hitman sounds for the guns. I haven't played Hitman in a little while, but... They do sound the same. Nice seven-round clip. Decent-looking reload. Right? Nothing wrong with it. Gun looks nice. Let's take a look at them. You know, inspect him here. Why is that so dark? I hate this sometimes. Like, if I put the sun on my back, like, it's because it's, like, looking at it like that. That's the wrong gun. This is the right gun. But, yeah, it does look nice. The model looks decent enough. I like the silver baller look a lot. The black one is nice, but the silver baller, you can actually see the texture detail here. It's got all the Hitman details on there, right? It does very much look exactly like the weapon from Hitman. So, we're going to go test this weapon out. Well, these weapons out in some combat. And see how they do as silenced pistols. Obviously, they got a lot of competition from Fallout 4 because the deliverer exists in the game and a silenced pistol. It's just good anyway, but we'll see how these ones do, and I'll see you guys when we get there. Alright, everybody, I've spawned myself deep into Boston here at the old corner bookstore, which always caused crashes for everybody. This one does extra damage. That was a legendary. Still one shot him, sneak attack. You just existed behind me all of a sudden. Is that still a sneak attack? I don't think so, but good enough. Thanks for the 45 rounds of spinning some here. What's your legendary wounding baton? Military grade duct tape, though. We're also close to some gunners. This is the ICA-19, so this one does bonus damage to people. Now, if I didn't get super fucking lost here. Like, I gonna head this way? And then you got mass fusion building, which is full of gunners, which is why I kind of want to test this out here. At least a little bit. We're not going to go inside any interiors and stuff, but look, I mean, the frame rate's holding out at least decently well. Yeah, this is the mass fusion building. No, you don't know I'm here. Did not one-shot him. It was even a sneak attack, I think. This one does do the 50% bonus, bonus damage, but it's not like a huge amount anyway. The headshot, though. Wreck those gunners. No problem. It's a decent little stealth gun. Let's switch to the silver baller, though. Just because I think it's got more coolness factor to it, because it's fucking silver. I hear somebody this direction. Oh, Art! Art and his... Oh, man. One of them is a synth. You're dead. That didn't kill him in one shot. More damage while I'm in God's sight. Yeah. Do you have a synth component? No, he didn't. Killed the wrong one. Hey! Hey! I don't know. I don't think Vats counts as aiming down sight. As you see, it's not like the most amazing pistol in the world. But, I mean, it's got a light weight, so its AP cost is relatively low. But there's nothing... This, is, this one was the synth. Doesn't matter, I kill both arts every time. Just for the kicks and giggles of it. Let's just sneak attack critical this super in the back. I mean, there's a legendary. Still did pretty. It did a lot of damage. You know, it's a pretty good pistol. It's, it's a solid work. I, I'm enjoying it here. Cryogenic leather chest piece. It's just more trash, dog. Could you give me less trash? The TOZ is a shotgun that we're going to cover in a future video, you guys. You guys should be excited about that. Just drop it on everybody. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's, that's a silver baller and the ICA 19. You know, some solid silenced pistols. If you're a really big Hitman fan, I'm sure you'll get more enjoyment out of it than even I do. I think they're good pistols. I think they're solid, you know, 
they have cool legendary effects, which I think stands them out as well. And you know, some basic level attachments where you can improve the weapon as you go. Easy to craft the chemistry station. You guys let me know what you think of this mod in the comment section down below. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please make sure you have a like rating down below. If you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe. That way you can check out more videos from me. And pretty much other than that, you guys have a good rest of your day. Whatever it may be. And I will see you in the next episode.